We're here at Hack Reduce. Uh, more specifically, we're at the Squirrel World, he World Headquarters, which is upstairs at Hack Reduce. Mark Terenzoni is here, the new CEO of Squirrel. Mark, good to see you. Great to see you, Dave. Yeah, so uh, we, you've been on all of three weeks, so uh, throwing you right into the fire. But um, first of all, congratulations. I mean, Squirrel, we've been tracking Squirrel now for over a year. Very excited about the innovations that are coming out, starting to create a lot of buzz in the industry. So what brought you here? Well, you know, f you know, first of all, the team. You know, it's a phenomenal team. Um, they've been working on the, the project for, you know, almost five years, which is somewhat unique to a startup. We're an eight-month-old startup, but the core of our technology is Accumulo, which is an OSQL, Open Source Foundation, top-level Apache project that has been developed by the NSA and brought out to open source in the last year. That core technology, Dave, has been running at very large scale, security focused, mission critical apps, you know, for over five years. So we're a startup that's bringing that core technology to market and commercializing it. You know, no one else has that, that advantage of a proven, co proven technology at the largest scale, bringing to a commercial marketplace. So that's, that, that was, that's number one. Number two, you know, big data is just, you know, exploding. It's exploding everywhere. Um, we have an opportunity you know, and, and every, anyone that's working with big data today, whether it's terabytes or petabytes, you know, three years from now, it's going to be ten times. So, yeah, the thing that interests uh, us about uh, uh, Accumulo specifically was, I mean, obviously, places in the government and certain areas like financial services uh, uh, are going to be much more sensitive to security. But what struck us was that by architecting security in and, and, and getting scale, you're going to solve some problems that others aren't, aren't, can't solve. We're, we're talking to a lot of practitioners that are hitting the wall on certain you know, NoSQL databases. So are you seeing that? I mean, I know it's only been three weeks, but, but you've got to be excited about the commercial possibilities. A absolutely. I, we're seeing a lot of traction in the for, for, uh, on the commercial side, in the financial community, um, even across multiple verticals, you know, we, you know telecom, you know, we're solving some unique problems. One of the use cases is cybersecurity, more specifically internal, where multitudes of different sets of data and log files need to be brought into the system. You know, we can bring that data in in its natural form, you know, without creating schemas. Let the system actually create the schemas on the fly and allow, you know, the practitioners to be able to see things that they never had the ability to see before because they had to, you know, almost um, decide what they were looking for. They don't have to do that with our system. That, the data can actually come in and show you, show you some edge case, you know, connections that you never saw before. So, you know, that's, we're seeing that as an early traction for sure. Um, and we focused, you know, a lot on the commercial. We know we're going to get some, you know, some Fed space, some of our early customers, and certainly where, where the product came from, in Accumulo being much more well known in the government sector. But uh, we're, we're, I'm trying to get some more focus around the commercial side of the business as well. Well, and I think, but, but I think that's an advantage for you too, because you actually are, are Accumulo is known inside a lot of government circles, and a lot of the, the, the commercial companies who are trying to get into the, the government space, you can actually help them there, and there's a quid pro quo, isn't there? Uh, absolutely, absolutely. And we'll leverage our relationships there. Um, there's a lot more of cooperation between Fed and, and commercial, and we'll certainly leverage that. But back to your, back to your point about security, um, we're seeing a lot of focus in the industry right now around security requirements in big data and in the stores themselves. Uh, I think there's been a couple you know, announcements in the, uh, in the ecosystem over the last month. Uh, the beauty of our technology is, as you mentioned, is that security was architected at the core of the design. Um, so because of that, there's very low latency as associated with that security. And, uh, you know, we're, we're seeing that as a tremendous advantage. Here. Well, I, I think, too, um, you know, we, we love to talk about Oracle. You know, they're, they're a lot of fun. And Larry Ellison's just great fodder for a company like ours. But one of the things he said last year at Oracle Open World was that security really should be designed in at the database level, not at necessarily at the application level. Now, you can certainly design it in at the application level. Many people do it. But if you have it at the database level, you can actually have a multi-tenant database, you know, in the cloud. And that's, again, something that Accumulo is really well suited for, isn't it? Absolutely. And, and, you, and if you think about it from that perspective, it's a cost saving scenario. It's a time to development scenario. When you have to develop applications, knowing what the security requirements not only are today, but what they may go to in the future, every application development is done differently. It creates vulnerabilities in the system. You know, you have to protect every aspect of entry into your, into your data. When you create it at the vault level at the database and create that you know, security at large scale, 
you, know, you don't have to really worry about what those applications are doing. It's much quicker to develop. It's much more cost effective. For example, you, the example you gave, multi-tenancy, you don't have to have silos of data to protect the, you know, to protect the, uh, the specific security needs. All you really have to do is use your security policies that you've already developed for your organization and apply them to our system. And you have that. And you have that coverage. Mark, I was out in California last week, and I was uh, meeting with the folks uh, over at HortonWorks. Of course, we love HortonWorks. We love what they're doing, pure open source. And they 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 brought up Accumulo. They actually brought up Squirrel. They showed me some one of their slides of their partners. And you know, you guys you know came up in the conversation. Um, so so that's got to be exciting. Working with with companies like HortonWorks, it's sort of the blending of of open source. Accumulo is open source, and then you're adding a layer on top of that. Can you talk about that a little bit? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we, we, we have a relationship with uh, Hortonworks. We've announced that about uh, six weeks ago. Um, we see them in the field. We work together. We're collaborating on a, on a number of opportunities. Um, you know, certainly great folks, and I look forward to uh, cementing that relationship even uh, even further down the road. Yeah, so how is the, how's the whole, you know, location, co-location with HackReduce working out? I mean, you got a lot of people in Cambridge. You know, talk about that culture a little bit. Yeah, this is, this is phenomenal. It's an, an epicenter. There's, uh, there's meetups here three, four times a week. Um, we have an opportunity. You know, the ecosystem, uh, the startup ecosystem is a lot different uh, today than it was, uh, you know, in my previous uh, days at, at startups. Companies are actually working together. It's you know, like it's a co-opetition model. Um, we're helping each other. There's a little bit of overlap in some of the things we're doing, but you know, I think we're we're kind of teaming up. And HackReduce is a, a phenomenal uh, place to to foster some of those relationships. Excellent, Mark. Well, uh, again, welcome aboard. We're, we're excited about the adult supervision you're bringing to uh, to Squirrel, and uh, good luck with everything. Thanks, Dave. Right, thanks. So great. Thank you. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll be right back. Keep it here. We'll be at the HackReduce SAP startup event all day, uh, covering it uh, end to end. My uh, partner John Furrier is here, so keep it right there. We'll be right back.